Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and it's a rather grey day outside, so that's why I've got the lights on. But anyway, in this video, I want to explain my reasons to why I am now only going to sell Shar out. So yes, officially, after the Manchester Derby match, I officially declared myself as only out. Now, here's the reasons why. Number one, the turning point for me was in midweek in that UEFA Champions League game, playing five in the back and two central defence midfielders. Suicide, absolute suicide, to set out formation to try and park the bus against RB Leipzig. Suicide, absolutely criminal. And then in the Manchester derby yesterday, no substitutions made apart from one one substitution in the Manchester Derby. An absolute disgrace. I'm sorry. This is the reasons why I am now Oli Gunnar Solskjaer out. As a player, absolutely love him. But as a manager, well and truly, as his depth. My goodness me. Just say we lose to Sheffield United on Thursday night. He definitely needs to be relieved of his duties. But, you know... It's just shocking how Manchester United have been doing, really. The home form has been absolutely nothing short but shit, in my opinion. I mean, what's that so far in this season in the Premier League? One win at home. Unacceptable. And we only won because we scored a penalty against West Brom. And we got very fortunate because the first penalty was saved and... We had a retake, but I knew at some stage that in that game in the UEFA Champions League, our luck would run out because you cannot keep making slow starts and expect to keep getting away with it. I mean, yes, I'm pleased that we didn't lose the Manchester Derby, but to me, completely, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer out of his step. I'm sorry. It's just my personal opinion. No, this is not me saying all the out to get views and that. I truly mean it, you know. On this Mr. Joshy J channel, I say it how it is. I'm on this with my player ratings and manager ratings. Look at Lee Gunner on his channel. A big Arsenal fan, and he says it how it is. And exactly the same on my channel. I say it how it is. So... In the comments, let me know down below, are you still back, Ollie? And why? If you are now, Ollie, out, explain your reasons why. Let's get a bit of a conversation going, but to me, out of his depth, needs to just do the right thing and let's bring in Pochettino before Real Madrid is snap him up. Because Pochettino is a decent manager. I know he didn't win anything at Tottenham, but he got them to a Champions League Final. I know they ended up losing to Liverpool, but Poch is. He can play very good football. To me, another thing why I'm, I am Ali out is because he's not ruthless enough. You know, I mean players like Jesse Lingard and that in the Sir Alex Ferguson era, they would have been out the door a long time ago. As I said, Paul Pogba needs to piss off in January. So, it's time for Soul Shard to go. I'm sorry. It's just how I feel. As I say, I love him in that. And there's absolutely no way I can hate him. Same as I, I didn't hate Jose Mourinho. I had a lot of respect for him. But I knew, at the end of the day, he wasn't the right man for the job. So, that was the cut-off point after we lost. To Tottenham Hotspur at Old Trafford was when I officially said Mourinho out. After losing to RB Leipzig and drawing the Manchester Derby yesterday, the cut-off point has arrived. I am now Ole Gunnar Solskjaer out. I just want what's best in this club. And for Solskjaer's legacy, I think to leave the club would be the right thing to do. Because... If we bring in Potch, 
maybe, but to be honest, I can't see Oli leaving until the end of the season. But if we snap up at Poch now, maybe he can take over from next season. But this is the reasons why I just wanted to bring this out. My reasons why I said Oli and the Solskjaer out after the Manchester City game. If he proves he wrong, then happy days, you know. I'll support him. But for now, I'm sticking to what I say. Out of his step, needs to step down, and let's bring in Poch. Bye-bye.